Hey everybody, it's Mother Goose 27 and welcome back to my channel. Today, we've got another story time video. So, when I was younger, I used to go snowboarding every every winter. It was one of my favorite favorite things to do. And I'm not going to lie, I was pretty good. Pretty good for like a 10 to 13 year old, as good as I guess I could have been at that age. Um and then I didn't go. I didn't go for like 10 years and a few months ago, my family planned a trip to Colorado. It was like a big family vacation, and we were going to go snowboarding, and I was super, super excited for it. And I knew, I knew that I wasn't going to be good, but I was like, ah, eh, I'll get the hang of it, and I skateboard all the time. I mean, not so much the last few weeks, but I, I genuinely, like, I genuinely skateboard a lot. It's one of my favorite things to do, and I was like, ah, eh, I've got my balance. I'll be fine. And, um... Long story short, I was not fine. <laughs> so I really wanted to just start on the bunny hill and just kind of get my groove, figure out how to turn, figure out how to stop before I moved up the mountain. But my family wanted to stay as a group and a few members didn't want to stay at the bunny hill. So me and a few of the other ones who hadn't gone in a while were forced to go further up than the further up the mountain than um we were probably than we were more comfortable doing and um it was bad you guys it was really bad i wish i wish i had some video to show you but i fell so much i fell over so many times and i think really the main problem was the first my first time down the hill i had fallen a couple times but i was able to catch myself but my very last fall on that hill instead of falling backwards and kind of catching myself, I fell forward and I hit the ground, like my chest really, really hard. And like, I felt like I couldn't breathe. That sucker hurt. And I, I literally had to like crawl, <laughs> crawl my way over to a building and like sit next to it. <laughs> like one of those little shacks they have. <laughs> and I literally stayed there for like 30 minutes. I w it was bad. I had, 20 30 more falls after that but and none of them really hurt i was able to ca catch myself but i think psychologically i was just so afraid of that happening again that i wouldn't let myself like get used to snowboarding like anytime i'd start speeding up i'd immediately force myself to fall because i was going too fast and i was afraid of that happening again and one of the really one of the biggest issues is because I skateboard a lot, I genuinely, I thought that they would be the same. They are not the same. When skateboarding or longboarding, when you want to turn, you move your ankles and you, you kind of twist the board like this. Or I guess if the board's like this, you kind of, you actually twist it and it'll make the turns. For snowboarding, you want to move with your hips and your shoulders. I just couldn't get myself to recognize like, turn like this. Like this, and I, I did. Somebody told me, just put your arms out and point the direction you want to go. But my ankles just kept trying to move the snowboard. <laughs> I don't know. I, I suck. I suck at snowboarding. But I'm not going to give up. I'm gonna, I'll am gonna. i go again next year. But it was really, really embarrassing. I was so embarrassed. Not only was I embarrassing myself in front of my family, but I was embarrassing myself in front of strangers. I'm going to end this now because... That, that's really it. That's the story. I'm an embarrassment to my family. Uh, <laughs> now, snowboarding was one of my favorite activities. At the trip, I was just like, I don't ever want to, I don't ever want to do this again. I want to stop snowboarding right now. <laughs> but because I enjoyed it so much as I did when I was younger, I genuinely do. I, I think that I would, I think that I would enjoy it if I just tried again and actually like tried to learn how to move <laughs> and how to actually stop that was the thing i did not know how to stop myself but you know what that's okay we'll figure it out <laughs> i'll figure it out anyway thank you guys so much for watching i really appreciate it if you enjoyed this video please consider leaving a like and subscribing to join the flock and i will see you in the next one mother goose out